<sighs> that was a really long interview. Hey guys, Corey here. And today we're gonna learn how to use markers to log in interview in Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's get to it. So here we have a raw interview. Let's take a look. When did you guys come here to America? Well, coming to America before it was Mari we were here mm. in Ecuador. Okay, so let's backtrack to the beginning. I know what the question is because I can hear myself saying it in the video, which is pretty helpful. When did you guys come here to America? Now, this seems like a good spot to mark the first question. So I'm gonna use the hotkey M for marker to mark that spot. Now you can see that a little icon appears over the footage on the timeline. If you look to the lower left, you can also see our clip in the marker window. If I were to double click that marker, a dialog box appears with a few options. Here you can choose the color of the marker if you'd like, as well as different types of markers. But for now, let's stick with the default options. For the name, I'll just put something basic. Usually it's what the question is. In this case, it's when they came to America. So I'm gonna type America arrival. Here in the comment section, you can add other notes if you like. Okay, and now click okay. So now if I were to hover over the marker, you can see that my notes appear. Another neat trick is to hold the option key and click the marker. And then you can just drag the duration of the marker wherever you'd like. The great thing is you can add as many markers as you need and they are all saved easily within the marker window. And when you need to go to a specific marker, just click on the endpoint. You can also use the hotkey Shift M to quickly navigate forward to the other markers in the timeline. Or use the hotkey Command Shift M to navigate backwards. You can also export your marker information. You can do this by going to File, Export, Markers. You can either do a CSV file or an HTML. And when you open that file, you can easily see all of your markers information and notes, which is really helpful when doing complex projects. So if you guys find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. I release tutorials every Thursday. You can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and feel free to ask me any questions. So what's your favorite method of logging interviews? Let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week.